Hologic presents a video guide to the collection of endocervical specimens by clinicians using the Aptima Unisex Swab Specimen Collection Kit. To begin, use the white cleaning swab to clean excess mucus from the cervical os and surrounding mucosa. Then, discard the swab. Now, insert the blue collection swab into the endocervical canal. Gently rotate the swab clockwise for 10 to 30 seconds. Next, withdraw the swab. Avoid any contact with vaginal mucosa. If the soft tip is touched, laid down or dropped, discard it and get a new Aptima Unisex Swab Specimen Collection Kit. While holding the swab in hand, unscrew the tube cap. Do not spill the tube's contents. Do not pour out the contents of the tube. If tube contents are spilled, discard and replace with the new Aptima Unisex Swab Specimen Collection Kit. Immediately place the swab into the transport tube so the score line is aligned with the top edge of the tube. Align the score line with the top edge of the tube and carefully break the shaft. Discard the top portion of the shaft. Do not puncture the top of the tube. Do not break the shaft above the score line. Do not cut the swab. Do not fold the swab in half. Do not insert the score line below the top edge of the vial. And do not push the swab to the bottom of the vial. Now, tightly screw the cap onto the tube. A barcode label should be affixed to the tube so that a quarter inch of space appears above and below it. Do not wrap the label around the tube or place it diagonally or adhere it too closely to the top or to the bottom of the tube. Endocervical Specimen Collection by Clinicians with the Aptima Unisex Swab Specimen Collection Kit. To learn more, visit hologicwomenshealth.com.